JJ, you already know it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. Listen, today we're gonna talk about you know how frameworks are a pro and how frameworks are actually a con for a new developer. Let's say right now, you guys, most of the people that come to my channel are actually new developers. It's mostly guys who are just having an interest on becoming a developer or becoming a programmer, becoming a software engineer, becoming a, a video games developer, whatever it is. But most of the time, it's new people coming in. So I'm just here to lighten up the spark, right? People, they look at online and look at a list that says, hey, top programming languages. And they're like, oh my God, I gotta learn, you know, 10 different languages because those are the hottest ones. In reality, you don't. And something that's really slowing down people is pretty much frameworks. Because you come and you'll be like, okay, one person says Angular is the best. Another person says React is the best. Now people are saying Vue.js is the best. Before it was Ember.js, and before that it was Backbone. So it's like every few months there's a new framework coming out, and pretty much everybody's just like, okay, they got scrambled to try to learn what's the newest one because everybody's doing tutorials on it. But at the same time, they haven't learned the basics. You have to be able to understand how that framework was actually created. Like what's behind it? Do you understand object-oriented programming? Do you understand classes? Do you understand you know, how variables work? Do you understand how if and else statements work? How loops work? How for each works? Like there's people who are using frameworks like Angular, Vue.js, and they're basically putting a lot of cool things into their their first website when they're like, oh yeah, they have this, they have a slider, they have a list looping or something, you know, something that's cool. At the end of the day, they don't know how to do that themselves on JavaScript. So it's really, really hurting. Them. So that's something that I think people got to address here. Like one of the main reasons why I love React is because you're actually just basically coding JavaScript. You're not in there doing something that's out of this world or learning a new new language and learning a new syntax like vbind or whatever you know angular had the same things where it was like binding html tags and you're learning something else you're not learning javascript and there's a lot of things that are good but it's hurting people my thoughts on this guys is pretty much learn the basics don't come in trying to learn a framework first learn the basics and stick to the basics until you're very comfortable on creating you know your own framework or your own library don't start using things if you don't know what's really behind it if you only know that if i put this here it's gonna drop a, a loop of of a, a list or a table like you don't want to do that you want to know how that's actually working make sure you subscribe make sure you like this video man it's your boy joe back at it again man i done did it again all right, guys, make sure you subscribe and make sure you like this video, man. If you want to support the channel, just click on the links below and basically click either on the Amazon link or you click on the Udemy link. So whenever you buy an item, basically like a little percent, I think it's like three or four percent, we get it back over here at the channel and we could actually help out other developers. If you didn't know, we actually give 25% of all the earnings to basically all the other developers here that are actually subscribed to this channel. 